What's up, Timekeepers? Me, Tom Gamer here, bringing you part two of episode one, Thesis of Orwell, Ignorance is Strength. So if you're ready, I'm ready. Time to roll the intro. All right, guys, we're going to be jumping right back into episode one, Thesis of Orwell, Ignorance and Strength. Uh, if you haven't seen the first part of it, go definitely check it out. The, these episodes are going to be a bit long because I don't want to separate one episode into five videos. So uh, they're going to be a bit longer videos than I uh, that I would like to, but they're still fun to watch. So definitely go check out the first part and uh, watch this part, of course. So without further ado, let's just jump right in. So let's go. Uh, do you want to tune in? Unknown person calling. Okay, let's go. Karen, my love. Hey. Having a good day? Yeah, yeah. Uh, so far, so good. I called to tell you I'll be home late today. I'm sorry. Again? Uh, they don't pay you enough for all the time you give them. Mm. It's not about payment, and you know that. These people rely on me. They need me. Yeah? Well, I need my wife at home with me some of the time. Am I asking for too much? Raban, not so long ago you were among them. You have been in their position. Yes, I know that. So was Ilya, so were the others. Yet none of us were national soldiers responsible for invading and ravaging countries. If it weren't for them driving refugees out in the first place, why, we wouldn't need these camps. This, again? We talked about this multiple times. I'm well aware that this mm. extra time you spend there is for her, isn't it? Raban, she is... I'm worried, that's all. She's more reclusive now than ever. Something isn't right. One more reason to avoid her. You want me to cherry-pick who deserves my assistance and who doesn't? All people get the same treatment, the same attention, that's my mandate. I thought... I thought you loved that about me. I do. You're right. Of course you are. You always are. <sighs> I'm sorry. It's... it's okay. So, are you good with me getting home late tonight, then? I am. Thank you. I will be waiting for you. All right. No, don't wait. It I'll might be get waiting late. for you. Well, I can hardly go anywhere else. You shouldn't say things like Psst. that. Anyway, <laughs> I'll talk to you later. See you. All right, so we have a couple of things here. National soldier response for invading the country. This. This might be pertinent to something. Invasion. Our effort at parts were justified operation to restore to keep peace. And we succeeded if it might add that. That's his wife. That's his, that's important. Who he has... Can I put that? Related document. Hmm. Makes me wonder how it must feel to be married to this guy. This guy. Oh shit, there's something. Uh oh. Two dead after second explosion. Oh dear god, now. Uh, let me just check this before I go see all the other stuff. Alright, holy shit, there's a lot of things going on here. Let's go to the headlines. Breaking news. Two dead after a second explosion. An explosive charge itself off in Stelligan University in Bonton. At least two people dead, three injured once again. Letter has been received just before the crime. Uh, half an hour explosion occurred at the campus. Bonton, according to the latest report, at least two people were killed. Further injured several. Uh, okay, this, this seems to be like the same events. going. This seems to be going parallel to the... Uh, the events of the first game so that's pretty cool actually that they actually involve it like that so uh prava secondary news 
Uh, news. Okay. Principal determined to keep school service going. Latest news report that stated that the troops of the terrorist group FTP are getting closer to Prava, uh, which made many parents raise concern about sending their children to school. Therefore, uh, to ensure the safety of people and teachers, the school and ministry has requested protection by the Persian army. Consider cooperation with Persian army. Okay, that's being a bit weird. Okay. Wait, army protected for a school? Seriously, thing must have been have been bad, or somebody must be been really worried. Okay. Okay, you gotta stop giving me paper here. Secondary library. Due to current event related to the new, the school administrators have now decided to provide a protective hideout from the combat activities. Are going to library to completely autonomous? Could be good for something. I don't know. We're gonna have to see. An autonomous shelter at school seems a bit overprotective, if you ask me. But then again, considering he thought he thought about gaining the army of protection as pa this pale of in comparison. All right. Oh, is there more things to check? News, faculty, Mr. Robin Vass, English for school principal. Here's a nice little picture. Handsome fella, ain't he? All right. Mission. Please find our tour record attendance via OK. Hmm. Let's see if Mr. Oleg Bakay ever attended this school. Sorry, there is no attendance. God damn it. Oh, wait. Uh, his daughter is a uh, Raka. All right, there's more stuff going on here. Uh, um, okay, home. Crime aesthetic continue to get fake. Real criminals do not show up. Uh, crime aesthetic continue to get head. The crowd pre presents new crimes aesthetic and wafer and their politics. But who are the real criminals? Okay, this is not pertinent to what we're doing. A journey. Uh, a journey. We say goodbye to our dear home. See you on the other side. Uh, by Arthur Robin Var. It's been a been about since I started the journey from my hometown private to the border of the nation together with my brother Ilya, who is the only family that I have left. I decided to seek a new life elsewhere. We have lost everything, our workplace, our home, or many of our friends. I've lost my ability to walk. I don't know how truthful this is. Uh, uh, the situation part is horrible. They're not... Uh, this generally surprised me. How did th that happen? Looks like they're getting your chance to investigate the mega profile, even if it's not your own, like in the aptitude test. Uh, okay. What's this? Wave projects likely c uh, cause rise in terrorism. Okay, this has arrival. Uh, what we encountered in a safe t safe country in the nation was not what we expected. We were assigned to Outer Bonner Reception Camp. It's calling Iliavar. Tune in. Iliavar speaking. Bravo. Oh, he hey, Raban. Uh, I didn't expect you to call. I'm getting ready for work. I have no idea what's going on with the donations. I swear they were working, and I haven't changed anything in the back end. Forget the donations. I need your abilities as my co-writer. You must write me an article. Uh, right now, is it important? 
It is. What do you want me to write about? There has been a second assault in Bonton, at Stelligan University. Another one? Oh, wow. They really have got a situation here, don't they? We need to cover it. Draw attention to how the government is failing its people. I'm not quite sure if I'll be able to pull it off at work. I feel like they're watching me already. Do you stand with me, brother? Or has the nation's corruption and wealth finally swayed your sympathies? Ravan, I stand with you. I've told you this. Then I have faith in you, brother. Are you preparing a statement about these threats? Mm. This has to stop. Are you gonna say something? Yes. Ah, great. Finally. And it is going to be the most remarkable statement I have ever made. The destruction of the cooperation between Cassett and Blaine. Hmm. Destruction? How? Patience, brother. It won't be long now. Take care of the article. Okay. Uh, I will do my best to get it done for you. Give me... Give me... About an hour for the draft. I'll put it in the back end. Good. I'll be waiting. Until later. All right. Yeah. Until then. All right, this is interesting. Upload complete. Uh, we got a little hubris, hubris going, haven't we? Not such, no such thing will happen. Cassandra Blade working together is the best thing that could ever happen to Parch. Why destroy it? Uh, what else? Uh, your ability to... Guess his brother writes his articles for him? Maybe? Okay. Uh, our social worker... Hmm, okay. Robin Var Merit is uh, his assigned social worker. Do you find this uh, odd as I do? It is a bit odd. Why does it say I have more things to view here? I already clicked on this. Did I? Oh no, uh, Kings of Hope. Okay. Uh, Central Medical Database, Arvar. Okay, we didn't have his date of birth, yes. Okay, so we have his current whereabouts. Or his residence, sorry about that. What? Still? I doubt that somehow. Okay, so we were looking to see, he said that he had leg problems. Arma has been buried by concrete blocks for the last 24 hours following the bombing. Two building in his hometown. Okay, this makes sense. What is legs problem? What? Buried and he survived this? Jesus Christ. You gotta give me a chance here, guys. Jesus Christ. Uh, oh, there's more info here somewhere. Okay, and okay, makes sense now to what we we're looking for. Uh, National Immigration Database. Okay. Social security number issued upon arrival. So he's not li he's not lying about his age, his date of birth. Okay, he's got a cool notebook. We're going to get access to his PC. And date of registration of when he arrived. Excellent. With that, we will be able to get the, a glimpse directly into the lines then and probably useful data on the target. Okay, whoa, whoa, too many things, too many names. This is good, that's when he arrived here. Well, right after the safety bill came into effect, bad timing for our point, their point of view, I guess. Okay, uh, never would have thought you'd gone this far. I always keep, blah, blah, crazy, but cancer, okay. 
Uh, I am not responsible for disappearing of the Long Bay. Besides, this man is not knowing Joe Leader. I have reason to believe he was involved in this horrid attack on my school back in 2010. Many children died because of him. I know that we he was one of the people in charge during private school attacks since knowing that what happened okay we'll have to see how truthful this is by comparing it to other details here no 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 pending article draft okay home mm. Okay. Again, when everyone told him to do, Redman ran out of the shed, saving his children from certain death. From, uh, save life of student from attack. Maybe? I'm not 100% sure on that. Okay, maybe. Saving Harry will risk his own life now. I see why his father treated him as a religious figure. Well, Agent, I think it's becoming clear already that Redman is only a shadow of his former self. His actions today are what matter. Okay, let's go here. Virgin School, hit by several missile due to, okay. The explosion which was initiated by the FTP caused the school prison overall to be buried under the crime group, blah, blah, blah. Mr. Roy was injured on Monday, December. Does this make sense to what his, I don't remember. The explosion which was initiated by the FTP caused by the school principal, Ra the explosion which was initiated by the FTP caused okay so show conflict so it says it was not the FTP the national behold is not the nothing but a lie manipulated to brainwash it really okay yeah that's okay so this is the truth because this is the news the yeah And yet he sympathizes, he, he sympathizes with the FTP. How does that make any sense? Is that a, a pun against me or? Okay, so I've checked all these documents now inside his computer desktop. The people's voice speaking out loud and when we need said. Uh, f to Freedom Plaza to do. Okay. A token of my appreciation for your blog. Uh... Hey, Robin, I found something you might have to be interested. Personal leak CNA Operation Flying Dog. I've done some digging through the documents and there were even a phone number of devices that issued to this guy. Okay, this is where David John, he he's the one that fucking... A fan, cute. This is what we're looking for here. So someone stooled on our fucking guy the number of the case protected phone number is out there this cannot be happening this is how Vermavar reached him and why who knows how many other people have his, this his info now this is a complete disaster okay, let's go here what is this website operation flying dog description operation flying dog is a document about how the Persian soldier Olin Bekay was arrested by soldiers of the nation after an incident during the civil war only to be released again later in place as a spy with him Okay, I don't know how... Let's let's see where this goes. Is this true? Damn it, I knew it might have been revealed. This changes everything. If the case secret is out there, that's how Vard came across the information. This alone does appear to be enough to be of a motive. Agent, I hate to say it, but we, with this new perspective on the situation, we have to put the loyalty into question. If we you find any hints of possible disloyalty of our agent towards us, you need to let me know immediately. Okay, about... About per personal leaks, nothing. 
Well, we only accept... Okay. If you would like to provide us with documents that is... Okay, no, I won't do that. So... System. Browser history. Okay, National Beholder. Headlines, okay. So, pictures. Private secondary rug rugby team. Do, 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 do. Cam ID. He doesn't seem to be stuck here. Bacay Metal. What? He talked to Kassar directly and he didn't inform us? Damn it, I, I have to assume this shows disloyalty towards us. Otherwise, we would have reported that in. Alright. Bacay Deal. Okay, this is more information. This has some kind of deal going on with VAR school. Okay. Summer 2013. Oh, wrong profile. Oh, there it is. Okay, that's what I was looking for. We believe that he would have been strong motive. Good. We can't work solely on what our beliefs, though. We need to clarify whatever any hints of Okay, okay. Might be relevant to something. President Paul, I've seen the meme before. I've seen that the memes before. The nation would have zero control over the part. Hmm, I guess we're treating it too clear where facts aren't given any weight. I have to be careful for that. I have to upload it. There's nothing else I can fucking upload. What? It's quite a coincidence there, isn't it? Oleg Bakay, what have you done? This would be very mean. Bakay is directly involved in the attack on Vara's school. I've seen enough. I believe I have sufficiently proven Bakay is to be involved in the attack on Vara's school. And Var knows about it and he has already stated that he believes Bakay has something to do with it. He must be out for revenge. In fact, the fact that Bakay has kept his role in this form and this from us all the time is... The fact that Bakay has kept his role in this from, in this, from all of us this, this time is not doing him any favor. There will be consequences. Yeah, we gathered all we need. I will get an intervention team ready for our local base near Prava to get and uh, and look for Bakay. Come on, Appleford. They're on the way. Now let me try and make sense of everything we gathered. I need to decide how we should approach this. Robin Vara was a school principal back in Prava Par Parges. He was also the teacher of Oleg Bakay's daughter, who went to fight in the Persian... Persian army. 
The school was sacked by FTP rebels. Varth managed to save the students by leading them to a shelter he built, but he lost his ability to walk. Based on the information we have collected, it is possible Bekay was involved in attack somehow. It is also possible that Varth, Varth learned about his and plotted revenge. If we had been aware of, the, of his move, involvement in the, in the act of urge towards the school, we would have never have recruited him. Now Bekay is hiding out somewhere in Prava for whatever reason. This is it, the theory about the situation we're facing. We will make sure to deal with it accordingly. The intervention team is in place. I'm switching over to the command and I'll let you listen to it via the listening tool. Tune in. All right, let's see what's going on here. Does Ampleforth have a voice? One reporting. Come in, command. Command is reading oh. you. We have arrived at the designated location. What is it like? Sorry, Command. I don't quite follow. The location? Tell me what you see. Looks like ruins of a school that has been hit by a large explosive. Possibly an airstrike. Maybe artillery fire. Hmm. Huh. Can you traverse the ruins? Affirmative. But the damage is catastrophic. Are you Pretty sure the target is around? Absolutely. Move in and keep me posted at all times. Describe to me everything you see. Understood. Echo Squad, move in. Entering primary hallway now. The hallway has been severely damaged. Hmm. You can see the sky right through multiple stories. Some parts are completely caved in. Proceed with caution, Echo Squad. The damage definitely originated some time ago. There's vegetation spreading all over the place. There are some adjacent rooms that seem rather intact. Okay, okay. Echo 2, Echo 4, clear them. Clear, clear. Rooms are clear. Lots of <laughs> bags lying around. All right, all right. There are still some geometrical drawings on the chalkboard. The place was clearly left in a hurry. All right. Moving into the next corridor. This intervention is taking a while. There's... Oh, shit! What is it? Part of the ceiling gave way. Nearly hit one of our operatives. Status, Echo Squad. Dust off. Ugh. Can you proceed? Affirmative. Do it. It's easy when you're not in the field. Roger. Moving on now. Well, can you keep going? <laughs> Are you dead, though? <laughs> Status? All clear. No traces of the target. Some doors are blocked by debris, but there's zero chance they have been opened recently. Listen, I need you to find the target person. He is around. There's a basement stairwell that we haven't checked yet. Moving there now. Watch your corners, Echo Squad. What if what the hell will you say this the whole thing is clear when you haven't checked everything? Not much left here either. The projectile went right through half the building like a hot knife through butter. Hate to say it, but we may be out of luck. Wait, found something. There's a hatch leading further down. Oh my god. Looks used recently. Finally, proceed. Affirmative. This is the school's library. Still intact. Someone put a lot of effort into turning this into some sort of autonomous bomb shelter. And they succeeded. Even the power is still on. Oh, From what shit. I can tell, this thing even has working surveillance cams on the walls. Huh. Peculiar. Maybe Bekay is able to use them. Proceed with caution. Definitely wouldn't want to. Movement! Get down! Get down! Echo Squad, contain the target! It's the target. It has to be. Come on. Oleg McKay, we know you're here. There is no way out of this shelter. Throw your weapons into the middle of the room and come out from your position with your hands on your head. Just do it, McKay. Just do it. Visual on target. Identity confirmed. It is Oleg McKay. Your order. McKay has been proven to be a traitor to the office. He is a liability as long as he is alive. Don't kill him. him. Don't kill him. Report in. Target down. Oleg Bekay is dead. God damn it. 
Very well. Mission accomplished. Make sure the area is secure, then disengage. <sighs> All right. Understood. Echo Squad, move out. All right, that's unfortunate. All right, he's dead. Hopefully, I gave them the right information. I'm sorry if I sh if I shocked you, Derek. Okay, endangered our efforts and our other agents by extension. Even you, we cannot tolerate that. Uh, I would have warned you beforehand, but I feared you would have second thoughts. You must not be in hindered by emotions. You will learn what it means to be a part of the office. Take this as your first lesson. W with time, you will. Oh, what the this bastard! The people's voice, Reb and Varth. It's streaming right now. You need to see this. Okay. Uh, the government of nation is lying to you. Hereby present you actual proof that the nation national has been lying to air alongside. Okay. Play podcast. The government of... Okay. My dear followers. Yes, this is exactly what you think it is. I found Oleg Bakay. What you see before you is an image obtained from a surveillance camera feed from the ruins of my old school, showing him among soldiers of the nation. These highly trained professionals cowardly shot him, a soldier in service of the Pagesian army, while he was hiding away from them. Now, as shocking as that image may be to you, the heinous nature of the national government is laid bare before you. Through their propaganda machine <laughs> called the National Beholder, they dared to make their false allegations against me and the people's voice as a whole. They claimed I'd be responsible for Bakay's disappearance when it was them all along. Oh, shit. But why would they murder a fellow soldier when President Kassat and Prime Minister Blaine are such close friends, you might ask? Oleg Bakay was the person responsible for the attack on Prava Secondary, the school I have been principal of a long time ago. And they knew it. They knew the moment he'd turn up dead, everyone would blame me. They took a life only to shut me up once and for all. But the people's voice cannot be silenced. God damn it. This is going to be trouble. So what is there to do for you, my dear followers, against the oppressive force of the national government and the Kassat regime? Do not listen to their corrupt and manipulative media outlets. Do not fail to remind Kassat what has transpired here today. Do not let them sweep this under the carpet to pass the buck, to influence you with such outrageously false information, to take a life to manipulate your thoughts. Or you may be next. Stand up for your rights and resist Kassat. Resist Blaine. Let's retake our country from President Puppet. Alrighty. How the hell did that happen? Where did he get the those pick? Oh no, no, the surveillance camera. God damn it, this this will have severe repercussions. I fear we will we will have some more containment to do. Even though we are facing a lot of trouble, you have done well. For now you may complete your work your work for today. Episode two Antithesis. Alright, so the next episode will be available on March 8, 2018. So we'll definitely check out episode 2 when it comes out. Hopefully you guys enjoyed episode 1. Uh, thesis, uh, that was good. Uh, so, yeah, I'm gonna... You probably saw I cut it in two parts. Uh, easier that way. So, uh, thank you so, guys, so much, guys, for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed Orwell. Uh, this game I enjoy a lot. Uh, I really enjoy the fake news aspect to it. And uh, I really like finding the information... Uh, it does add a couple more mechanics to the game. So it's going to be fun to see. I, th I think there's only three episodes this time around. So we'll have to see in the next two episodes. So antithesis for the next one. So uh, thank you so much guys for watching. Hit that like button. Subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed it. Of course, leave a comment below you what you thought of uh, episode one thesis. Would really know your facts and uh, what you... The way you played it through, of course. Uh, follow me everywhere. Me Time Gamer, Twitter, Twitch, Facebook, Instagram. And right here, YouTube.com forward slash Me Time Gamer. Where I post a new video every day week, Monday to Friday, 3 p.m. Eastern Time. So thanks so much guys for watching, and I will see you next video. Keep on keeping on.